Hello everybody, let's focus on this simple linear algebra slash linear system theory problem. This is an example problem, right? And here there are given two functions or operators, right? Defined on those given vector spaces, right? And E function is defined on this, defined by this, right? Expression and S function defined by this expression. And part A asks whether T is linear or not, right? And it also says if it is linear, please find the matrix that corresponds to that given function, okay? And just by looking at the, I mean, expression, we can directly conclude that, of course, this is linear, right? And <clears throat> this is part A. And part B asks the same for this is typo s right s function right and part c asks the same for another function and that function is defined by mood um, applying t and then s right let's call it g function and g function is s and then t right okay it asks whether this g function is linear and again if it is linear find the matrix that corresponds to that given function right okay let's just focus on the first focus on the part a e matrix here this is the case right and again we can since they are all linear right or entries are linear right we can write this in that form and here that matrix we can since we can write this in matrix times the given vector right we can conclude t is a linear operator on that given vector space r2 right okay and the, this is the matrix that corresponds to that linear operator again part b here this is the s function and here we can notice that there is some non-linear not linear term right this is non-linear right and linearity is very important and since there is one non-linear expression we can conclude that we cannot write this in a matrix times vector form so s is not a linear operator on that r2 vector space all right let's continue and here let's focus on this another function right we will first apply t operate on that xy vector right and here this is the definition of t right just definition of t right and then we will we will let me write this apply that right first plus second right first plus second and second is zero right and this is the case and then and then here let's look at the definition of s fu function first times second right first times second and this is zero all right let's check if the given expression is linear in x y and of course it is linear right Two times x this is linear one times y one times y this is linear right and this is the matrix that corresponds to that uh, composite composite function right okay and that's all thanks for watching